In this video, we're going to help you diagnose the soap dispenser in your dishwasher. So to diagnose your soap dispenser, you'll notice that they have a rubber seal on the back of them. Over time, between the hot water and the expansion contraction, the seal may start to leak. They'll actually sometimes even get hard, brittle, and crack, and you'll get water um, moving past them. So when it's in the machine, and the spray action is taking place and the water is splashing against the door and against the dispenser, uh, or against the dispenser in this direction from inside, it can actually force its way around past that seal and you'll start to get water um, coming into this area between your outer and inner door and it'll start to run down and drip onto the floor. So if you're getting some small drips uh, coming down from uh, the side where your dispenser is, this may very well be the problem. As well, if you needed to uh, find out if the dispenser is working properly or not, on this one you'll see that they actually have a little coil, uh, an electrical coil, solenoid, that is used to operate the dispenser. It does two functions. It operates the dispenser and it also operates the um, rinse aid dispenser as well. So basically the timer will energize this coil and it'll cause it to pull back and it will open up the door to allow the pod to drop out inside the, uh, inside the tub. It will actually energize a second time later on in the cycle and it will activate um, the uh, rinse aid dispensers to allow a couple little drops of rinse aid to go into uh, the dishwasher to give you that sheeting action that you need. So to test that coil, we're just going to use our multimeter. We're going to set it on a continuity setting that gives an audible sound when we touch our leads together. And if we take our leads and put them on the coil, one lead on one terminal, one lead on the other, we'll get an audible sound. And that means that coil is good. If that coil was bad, you would have to replace the coil. If you can get the coil separate, that's great, but on a lot of machines, you would have to replace the entire assembly. But that's how you diagnose your uh, detergent dispenser.